What's good, YouTube? I'm back with another video. Like always, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit the like button, comment on all the videos, all that good stuff. Today, today is May 6th. So yesterday, of course, was Cinco de Mayo. Uh, I did DJ last night. DJ at a club, I don't know, a strip club, but it had strippers in it. But yeah, I DJ in the club last night, but I didn't record anything last night. It was too hectic. Like, I was too busy. Like, I was like working, working last night because I had to deal with artists last night. So, I do that every Thursday for the most part. Well, I deal with artists. And every time I DJ, because, like, in a strip club, at least in Atlanta, I don't know how every other city is, you get a lot of artists coming in there that want their song played. So, yeah, you deal with artists a lot. But yesterday was a straight, like, performance. I swear I only played, like, Regular music, like known music, for probably about an hour, maybe hour and a half tops, and then the rest of the night it was just performance after performance after performance after performance, getting people music, doing all that good stuff. So yeah, but today six, today is the six, so it's Friday. Um, we in the actual strip club tonight. Y'all already know it's Friday, what we call Friday, the Booty Club Friday. So that's where we at Friday. Uh, right now, I guess. Uh, not I guess, but I will show y'all, because y'all ain't really see how I prep to DJ, for the most part. Yeah, so today, Friday, is a perfect day, but like, you do all your prepping, really, to me, honestly, it's like, mostly Friday, because Friday is the day all new music drops. According to you, you get like a random drop on like a Wednesday or a Thursday or something like that, like you do get random drop, but for the most part, everything drops on Friday, like people drop their new music videos all the other stuff, and then I had to go find them. So I'm finna show y'all pretty much how I prepare the DJ. Um, I really need to go to my car to actually get my book bag so I can get my laptop out and start doing that. Uh, I pretty much got most of the music because like th this week, this Friday, ain't too much really came out. Like Future album came out again, but it got like four or five bonus songs or something like on there, on there. So I guess it's deluxe. It don't say deluxe, but yeah, it got most songs on there. But I already got the album anyway. I got a bunch of stuff. And also, too, is like, with me, I always like to just go find new new artists anyway. That's hard. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I do the showcase thing or whatever like that. Sometimes I go back, listen to their music, and see what's hard or not, pull some of them songs. And also, I just find stuff on the internet or Instagram or whatever the case. Like, so, yeah, that's what we do. So, well, that's what I do. I don't know about other DJs. That's what I do. So, for right now... I'm gonna go outside, go get my book bag, all that good stuff, and we're gonna start this process. Damn, it's my first time outside today. It feels kind of decent. Oh man, also, I want to tell you guys Tuesday night, got me a new spot. Well, I wasn't DJing Tuesday anyway, but yeah, I found a spot on Tuesday. Of course, this is another strip club. Um, finna really see what I can do with that night. It's me and a couple other promoters. Got that night. I might have another night also well on Wednesday night. I'm not for sure yet, but I'm working on that. Yeah, so the more nights I get and different spots I get, at least now I could really show y'all more different content because, like, for the most part, I'll be in the same club four nights in a row. So, like, tonight, the club I'm at tonight, I'm there on Monday. So... At least now I can give y'all different clubs. At least a different club. Hopefully two different clubs. The other one come through. And then y'all can see different, different everything. Different clubs, different styles, different strippers, all that type of stuff. So yeah. But one thing gonna remain the same. Shit. The DJ and the music. I need to change shirts. Like somebody chewed on my collar. Yeah, so I got that coming up for y'all. So at least y'all see something different. And like I say, you know what I'm saying? Y'all can see me grow as a DJ. So now I'm finna be in more spots and doing more things. Networking with a bunch more people. So yeah, that's the whole thing about being in Atlanta too. It's easy to network, but when you network in Atlanta, make sure you're networking with the right people. You just don't want to network with anybody. You know what I'm saying? Like, because down here, so many different people down here. And I ain't gonna lie to you, a lot of people that be capped. A lot of people ain't gonna give you no opportunity. You gotta, you gotta be plugged in to the right groups, right groups of people, you know what I'm saying? So you're gonna go through your ups and downs with the network. So you're gonna meet a lot of cat people at first, especially if you a female down here. Everybody gonna cap you down. But yeah, let me go on ahead, 
Get my computer set up, and then I can show y'all how I start preparing the DJ. All right, so I'm back in the house. Got everything set up or whatever. So now I really get to show y'all how I kind of prepare the DJ. I ain't finna go through the whole long run because we gonna be sitting here for hours looking at me do this. So I'm finna give y'all a quick rundown of how I do this. So I don't know if other DJs do this or not. I don't know. Like this, this is my process. Cause I. I could easily, never mind. Y'all just see, y'all just see. All right, first thing first, normally what I do, see, I got two computers, right? That's the Mac, this right here, Mac laptop, Mac Pro. I need to get a new one. I want the one with the little black bar to go right here. Y'all know what I'm talking about, but anyway. So normally what I do is, like I'm on YouTube on both of these. Normally I download all my music on this computer right here. So normally what I do is I say like, for example, this song or whatever right here. I ain't gonna play it because I'll probably get copyright anyway because we all see who song is here. All right, so normally what I do with songs that I cannot find on like iTunes and stuff like that, what I normally do is take them off YouTube because that's the only place they be at YouTube. So I will show y'all how I download them off YouTube and I don't want them to see this and then take the site down and stuff like that. But I normally just download the songs off of YouTube. And once I download, then I'll probably download albums and stuff also as well. Cause look, look at my iTunes library. Hold up. That's just the bottom. Like, and this computer right here has way more songs than this computer. Cause I ain't transfer everything over. But as you see, I have all, cause like I say, this week ain't no really new music come out. But only, like I say, the new Future came out. They came out. This dude right here, he an artist from Atlanta. I probably gonna play one of his songs. Uh, I just download some stuff, some old stuff. Lucky, he from Chicago. I don't know if y'all know him. But look, God, it dropped his album. He dropped it like on Wednesday or Thursday and stuff like that. So, yeah. So, like, right now, I ain't gonna lie. I'm playing this all weekend. Let me click on it. Let me skip through some of that. Yeah. Gang. Okay. This hard to me. You know. Said, oh no, got my monitors. Yeah. Monitors yeah. on point. Young Rogan, yeah. be back at it. Wow. Wow. I was really robbing. Got tired of fucking starving. Now a nigga got rats in. Now a nigga pets in. All the gang fuck. Alright, that's enough of that. Like, y'all y'all see that? That was hard to me. I don't know about y'all, but that was hard. But you know what I'm saying? Pretty much download all my music, right? Because also, too, I'll show y'all on my laptop. But I download all this music, save it, put it in folders, all that good stuff. Like, hold up, that's email. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Uh, I probably gotta open it up, but click on here, go to downloads. All right, so pretty much download folders. Y'all see, I got so many. All these folders is just music, like people albums and stuff like that. So I put them all on this computer, and then I put them on my hard drive and transfer them to this computer. Now, once I got my music on this computer, pretty much uh, go to iTunes. I put all the music I put on my hard drive, I put it on this so it stay updated. So most of the songs you see on this, it's gonna be on this computer as well. But like I say, a lot of this stuff I ain't transfer over yet. Cause like I say, this computer right here has way more songs than this computer. And this is the computer I actually DJ with which is crazy. Yeah, but once I upload these songs in here, pretty much, uh, put them in iTunes, like I say. Once they're all in iTunes, and then this is what I do next, all right? I put all the songs in iTunes, I listen to some of these songs to feel like who got the more of the strip club vibes or whatever, because a lot of these songs be, it's good to have all these songs, because people request for certain songs or whatever, at least I have it, because I try to download almost everything. Um, but I mainly listen to the ones that, like, I know there's going to be a hit type thing. Yeah, a little said they had that strip club bounce. Excuse the yarn. But, like I say, once I listen to all of them like that, I go here. Now, you a DJ, you pretty much know what this program is. Pretty much most DJs use this right here, Serato. So, that hooks up to my my board or whatever like that, and then I can DJ. Right now, it's just in this plain little simple mode. Don't look like, because I don't have it connected. So, yeah, right now... I'll put it in this. I mean, I won't put nothing in this, but pretty much when I put it in iTunes right here, and then I will open up this, and when I open up this, you see it has the iTunes library. Click on music. Now all my songs that I had and put it in here is in here now. Also as well, you can see on the side, 
You see they got Tidal and SoundCloud, other programs. I, I think they use Spotify and stuff like that. Only reason why I don't really, because I don't necessarily have to download a lot of this music. Because if it's on Spotify, if it's on SoundCloud, and it's on Tidal or whatever, they will have it on there, and I could just use that. Uh, hold on, let me see something real quick. Oh, uh, there you go. All right, y'all probably see it better now. Yeah, so, with a lot of that stuff, I don't like really using it because you go to these clubs, either they Wi-Fi moves slow as ever, and then you try to use your hotspot, then you got to make sure your phone charged and this, and your reception probably not good in the club. So that's why I like really like downloading the music myself so I can actually have it and don't have to really worry about that problem. But anyway, uh, once the music get in here, what I do, I hit this button right here. This analyze button and what that button do is pretty much put all the BPMs on there. I know a lot of y'all like what is BPM? This beat per minute. I ain't finna break that down too much because I ain't trying to bore y'all. But yeah, anyway, I put them all in here. And like I said, I listen to the songs anyway. And when I listen to the songs, like most stuff is blue or whatever like that. Like hold on, let me go back to that one song I just played y'all. Alright. And then after that, I don't know y'all see these little markers. I have my little markers, so my little cue points. So when I hit it, it goes straight to a certain part of the song. So I can start it from this point, which is the dead beginning. And then you see how the black line I can start it from there. You know what I'm saying? So I put all my cue points in there. And once I do that and all that good stuff, I put it in my folders. I got my folders organized, all right? So I pretty much do this for every song I like. I didn't say I like that. I feel like it's going to be a hit type thing. And then I do this for all the songs and put it in these folders. That was probably the quickest way to really explain how I DJ, you know what I'm saying, prepare to DJ. But also, too, the thing is when you get all these new songs or whatever like that, I ain't going to lie, you don't even remember. Like, you'll go to the club, have all your, damn, I'm finna play this new song, I'm finna do this, I'm finna do that. You don't even remember how the song you can download, because it'd be so many songs come out in a day type thing. So, yeah, that's that's how it go. That's how the process go. It's boring, it could be long, it could be short, but if you stay on top of it, it really don't be that bad. When you don't stay on top of it, you'll be sitting here for a couple of hours trying to get your music organized and stuff like that. So, uh, all my DJs out there that's trying to be a DJ, stay on top of your music. Stay on top of your music. Keep it organized. Keep you know all your files, all that stuff. At. Just keep everything organized to make it easy on you and stay on top of it. Because you don't stay on top of it. Say you skipped a couple of weeks, ain't download this, download that, or whatever the case, then you're going to be running back. Hey, I got to get this. I got to get this. I got to get that type thing. And also, too, like, for my DJ people, go to different clubs and see what other DJs play, too. Because there might be a song you might even missed over or looked at. You know what I'm saying? Like, stuff sound different in different places to me. I don't know about y'all. Like, if I listen to a song in a car, it might sound good in the car. But then that song might sound better in a club or worse in a club. It don't matter. Like, I don't know. With different places and different vibes, the song sound different to me. I don't know. Y'all let me know if y'all feel the same way. Like, certain songs, I like, you listen to the club, you... Certain songs make you like it when you hear it in a club compared to if you was just listening to it some headphones. You probably skipped that song, but then when you hear it in a club, it make you like the song. So I don't know. Certain songs do that to me. So yeah, I like listening to other DJs and stuff like that. So I can get different songs and different and add them to my arsenal type thing too. Like, ask them, you know what I'm saying? Hey, what song is that? Whatever case like that, get them. Like some DJs, y'all do be like bougie or whatever like that. Like y'all want a song from me, I get it. I really don't care. You know what I'm saying? Music spreading around, whatever like that. So that's all I'm saying. Like most DJs, like nah, this is my music. You can't have it. You can't get this. Get this. Man, shut the music. It ain't nothing but music. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's how I prepare. I'm finna finish preparing, and then I get back with y'all later when I get ready to go to the club. And then you know we at the club tonight. All right? I don't even know y'all. barely probably can see me right now, but we at the club right now. Sitting in the parking lot. Gotta put my shoes on. I hate putting on shoes. Like I should just walking out with my slides. I really don't feel like putting on no shoes. Um, and if you can see out there, go what it look like. It's a decent amount of cars. We ain't need that many cars. But it's still early, though. It ain't number but what? Nine, nine thirty on the dot. Oh, bruh. 
Finna go in here, set up, see what it's looking like. Like I said, it's probably ain't too much spectacular. It's still early, so I ain't tripping. We got all night. We here to what? 3 30 in the morning. So yeah. Let me go down and get my stuff, put my shoes on, and walk in this damn club. Alright. That's my favorite line. I should should have coined that. Alright, 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 alright. Yeah, that's my I should coin that phrase. I do say that shit a lot. But yeah, let me get my stuff and get up out of here. Oh, man. All right, I still ain't got out the car yet. Like, I'm halfway out, as y'all can see. I just want y'all to see my G-Phase up, that's all. Like, I ain't never seen a pair of four, but yeah. I just want y'all to see my G-Phase up, that's all. No wrinkle in the toe whatsoever. Yeah, no wrinkle. All right, well, let me take my ass in here. Man, tonight was hell. And then you have to do nothing with the dance and everything else. I mean, the dancing and the costume, I don't know what it is. This whole night was weird. <laughs> I couldn't even record. There's too much personal stuff going on. Yeah, but I'm finna finish packing my stuff so I can get the hell on. There ain't nothing going on in here. My bad, I'm distracted. I'm looking for somebody. Yeah, let me go down and finish packing my stuff. So I'm going to get up out of here. There ain't nothing really going on. It's dry as hell in here. So I don't think ain't no fun. This time going to happen tonight. Maybe tomorrow. Tomorrow's Saturday. So somebody might be doing some arguments or something might happen. So, yeah. Yeah, so I'll catch y'all when I get up out of here. The next day. Hey. Last night was wild. It was for a bunch of whole other reasons. But overall, if I was a club scene last night, and it was kind of dry. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. They really weren't throwing money at all in there. Like, I don't know. Like, maybe also two, Cinco de Mayo, Thursday. Then on top of that, it was, everybody had to pay their rent. So that's why probably money was kind of slow yesterday. I don't know. I'm just trying to get an excuse. Oh, man. Yeah, but now, shit, I'm just getting back to the crib. Parking the car. I don't know how I'm parking the car. I probably parked it crooked. But this car next to me just crooked. I don't know. Yeah, it's the middle of the day. I don't know what time. What time is it? I think it's about 3, 4 o'clock. Look like it's going to rain outside. Ain't too much going on. Let's say shit. I'm pretty much probably going to uh, pretty much just chill. Chill for a little bit take a nap then we back at the club back at it tonight today's saturday so hopefully uh, tonight be way better than last night oh man about time to get my hair retwisted what y'all think yeah it's about time to get the hair retwisted oh well i don't know i might thug it out for the month then get it retwisted too uh also what's going on ain't too much going on man like i said i'm finna chill oh man chill get out this car and shit, I think the game, I'll probably go watch the game and shit. Just get ready for the night. Like, when you DJ, like, ain't too much exciting stuff going on, like, outside of the... It can be, but it just be like, by the time I leave the club, go home, go to sleep, I wake up. I don't feel like doing nothing. Because, like, I'll probably wake up about 1 o'clock, maybe 2. I hate getting up at 2, but I try to I try to get up, like, around 11. Sometimes that don't work. Like, today, I literally ain't wake up to what? Uh, what time did I wake up? It was after 12 or something. I think it was like almost 1 o'clock when I woke up today. So, yeah. Once you wake up, it be traffic, especially in the line. It be traffic everywhere. I don't even feel like moving or what. Like, stuff I gotta get done, I get done during the week. As far as, like, important stuff and whatever like that. Hell, even, like, haircuts and all that stuff. I do that stuff during the week or the weekend. I ain't really finna do it. Because I wake up too late 
in my eyes. Cause I'm like, I like getting up early, early, but you ain't walking to the house at five, six in the morning. You're not going to wake up at nine o'clock. You can, but you're going to be drained. But yeah. So if I'm going ahead, lay down, do what I got to do. Watch TV, whatever, relax for the most part. I mean, I ain't got to do nothing. So I'm going to go ahead and relax. And after that, I'll get back with y'all when I get ready and stuff like that. And then we on day two. Day two at the club, all right? Later that day. All right, so I got dressed, all that good stuff. Uh, right now, y'all already know where I'm at. Well, y'all don't know where I'm at. I'm at freaking Walmart. Only reason why I came up here, because I had to get some lighters. Because, like, I don't know. For all my people that smoke, is it just me or your lighters just disappear? Like, I know last night, because last night I went to a gas station model lighter. Left out the club with it. Now it's disappeared. I can't find it. Ain't in my pants pocket. Nothing. Not in the car. Like, I don't know what the hell happened to it. Where my car keys at? So I'm finna run in here. Go grab a pack of lighters. Not just a lighter. Pack of lighters. Because I can't deal with them little crackhead lighters. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I gotta be a big lighter. I can't deal with them other lighters where the flames shoot up extra high and all that stuff. Nah, I don't do those. I feel, I feel like a dope fiend or something when I use them. End of the night shit. Finally over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that, man. Yeah. All right, so pretty much let me break down like what happened kind of last night. Because last night, my dumb ass didn't realize I was running out of storage. So it kept cutting while I was recording. It kept just cutting off like stop recording, stop recording, stop recording. So it was choppy. So then I realized, like, I finally realized, I don't know what made me realize, like, I'm out of storage or whatever like that. Because they didn't pop up and I say that storage for short or anything like that. So I realized I was just out of storage. So certain clips I couldn't get. Couldn't get a lot of stuff in there for y'all. But, oh, well, y'all see what I do. Y'all see it every time y'all watch one of my videos or what, pretty much of what goes down in the club. Um, Yeah, so... I'm still going, well, y'all probably seen, y'all looking at this, y'all looking at, ah, I can't even get it out right, I don't know what's wrong with me, but if y'all made it to this point of the video, obviously, I'm saying y'all seen the clips I did have, so I apologize for that, but I'm saying, like I said, we go to the club anyway, all the time, so I messed up on a couple of clips, so y'all be alright, so, but I'm finna go on in this video, like I say at the beginning of the video, man, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff to the channel. I'm coming with more videos and more videos and more videos. So I'll see y'all next time. So peace. All right. <laughs>